Great, it's the 28th of June. We're at St Paul's and St Peter's Church. Or is it St Peter's and Paul's Church? Either way, we're in Seal. And what's just happened, which is interesting, offline, off camera, sadly, uh, I hear you say, yeah, right. Um, always the way down, it's off camera. Um, two of our colleagues saw a white light from over there at the organ, which is quite interesting. Um, when we were talking, and I'm getting this very interesting sense of energy um, all around me right now, and it's increasing, and it seems to be increasing in this area, which is quite good. We also had some knocking, as if someone was trying to communicate with us, and that was quite important as well. Um, walking around, I get a set, and I am I'm absolutely buzzing now, which is quite good. So we're going to try and get something happening. Whether we do or not, who knows? Might be offline. But the, I certainly saw an apparition over there near that doorway, which makes sense because that would be the original doorway for the vicar, the priest, the reverend, the rector to come into the church to take his service. The congregation's in, the rector arrives and comes in to his aisle high water. So we're just going to have a quick, quick look around, uh, which is interesting, to say. I believe the lady in question that is around this area is a lady called Dorothy from that period that I mentioned on the previous film clip that we did. So is there anyone here that wants to just um, communicate with us and, and say something? Show us that you're here. I can see lots of Freemasonry symbols and emblems and various things. And just something that lets us know that you're trying to communicate with us, I guess. Okay, let's head over to where we saw, I saw the apparition, which is quite interesting. It was, it was a flash, and it was almost like a flash and gone in a matter of milliseconds, but just enough for me to catch it, to put on. And it came from this area, which I'm not surprised actually, because we've certainly got, we've certainly got the most interesting cloth in the church here. Um, and to blink, you can almost miss it, because I think a lot of us did. But this tapestry, that altar isn't the high altar. The main altar is this one. And look at this, the most amazing work on there. Gilded on there. Fleur de Lis and the cross with the wonderful ascension symbols. The rose, obviously. What an amazing piece of work. Um, absolutely detailed. Beautiful. It's got such a lovely feel to it as well. Amazing. Let's just try one more time over here. So is there someone here that wants to speak to us? Perhaps Dorothy? A Dorothy that wishes to speak or show us a sign that you're here? We might get something on EVP, we just don't know until we review that later on, but that would make sense with the bloodletting of the, the stained glass window and the, the spilling of blood in sacrifice against the wonderful, wonderful Celtic design. Um, very dowry after. Very much so.